Hello everybody, hey, it's me, A-Z-R-O-A-H, happy new year. Um, I just wanted to share a word that God put in my heart um, today, quickly. Uh, I know it's been a while, um, but let me just get straight into it. It's about relationships, and I was listening to the story of Adam and Eve today in church, and I realised that whether or not you believe in the one or not, that Adam was the only example where God definitely wanted him to be with a one person and that person was the best possible, the perfect, whatever you call it. It was the person that God wanted Adam to be with. There was no doubt about that. And that's the only case in the whole of history that we can definitely say that it's definitely who God wanted those two people to be together. And you can see that the result of that, well, the result of that relationship, but within that relationship, um, obviously, you know, Eve ate the apple and then, you know, now we have sickness, disease and all this awful stuff. Just because you are with the right person does not mean that things can't still go wrong. So I guess the word is just to say that just because something has gone wrong does not mean that you're with the wrong person. Uh, I guess this word is sort of aimed towards perfectionist people like me who like if something tiny goes wrong, I'm like, nope, this is the wrong person. I have to end everything and <laughs> try and go with someone else. That's so mean. It's not saying me that loud. But yeah, um, God is perfect but we are not. And even if we are in the exact relationship God intended, it does not mean that everything's going to be smooth, flowing and sailing. And of course, you know, in light of the recent news with, um, I don't want to say who, but certain celebrities, in fact, no, I mean, just say who, Megan Good and Devin Franklin, obviously they are getting a divorce. And when they were getting together, they both told their testimonies individually of how God brought them together. And I was asking God, I was saying, but God, if they were meant to be together, like just in general, even just with them, but in general, if two people are meant to be together, then why did they divorce like how could something go wrong but just because god puts two people together does not mean that everything's going to be perfect it doesn't even mean that it's going to come to a good end you know it's up to us to continue walking with him and um praying for his strength and his mercy daily to help us to grow to become more um more christ-like so we can love our spouse and love ourselves and love god and just do effectively the right thing do well in life um so that's the word that I have. That was a very short word, two minutes, 30 seconds, that's good. So I hope you guys are well. Um, I think I might film a few other words, because I actually got like three words there this morning, so I might film three different videos. As you can see, I was just in my room, like, I just, I didn't even, just hopped on in quickly for a little quick, you know what I'm saying? But um, yeah, I hope you guys are really well, and I love you, and yeah, God bless you.